Yes, Lord. Our Father. Yes, Lord. You have known us from our early existence even up until this day. Yes. We ask you, Lord, for your guidance, for understanding, for wisdom, and for knowledge. Yes. That this, my brothers and my sisters, might know your will. Yes, Lord. How to live and talk and walk for you, Master. Yes. Be our light. And be our guide. We need you and we can't get along without you. Yes, Lord. We ask you in Jesus' name. Jesus, Lord. Touch every man, Church. every woman, Church. every girl, and every boy Church. in this assembly today. Church. Be with them and guide them and give them the strength to yes. do your will yes. above all the trials and tribulations yes. that they will face in this world. Yes. We need you and we can't get along we need you. without you. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' name, bless the Pastor of this church, my heart and mind to do your will above yes. his or anybody else's. We just thank you. Bless every man, each woman, each minister or that's in the audience today. That God be with us yes. as we break the bread of life yes. to be better men and women for you. Yes. It is in Jesus' name we do praise and thank you forever and ever more. Amen. 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 You tell me y'all been having a good time all Jesus. week, huh? Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah, y'all. Thank you, Lord. When the Word of God lifts you, you ought to enjoy it. And Amen. Have pleasure in it. Amen. Amen. Tonight, we're going to talk about some of us. Uh huh. Huh? All right. And who we belong to. Amen. 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 See, a lot of times in, in, in our life and in our go goings and doings, we get confused. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we get grown. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we be our own man. Sometimes we be our own woman. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we be our own girl. Sometimes we be our own boy. Yep. But we need to get it right. Yeah. Amen. We need to get it right. If you're going to go and, 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 and meet Jesus when he come back, you need to have it right. Amen. 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 Huh? Amen. Amen. From the book of First Corinthians, some of Paul, what they call hard writings. Amen. Uh -huh. Look at chapter, at verse 19 and 20. What chapter? 19. Six chapter. Six chapter. Verse 19 and 20. First Corinthians, six chapter. Verses 19 and 20. This is a sobering message. Might even be boring to somebody. All right. But I'm going to tell you the truth. Bring the word. Unless you don't get it right, it won't be born in the end. Bring the word. Say that right now. It will not be born in the end. Amen. Amen. Everybody ready? Amen. Okay, we're starting at the 19th verse. And listen at the first word. Mm -hmm. What? What? Mm -hmm. Huh? What? There's something that came before that. Amen. Amen. We're going to get there, but it say what? Uh -huh. Know ye not that your, your body is a temple of the Holy Ghost, uh -huh. which is in you, mm -hmm. which ye have of God, and ye are not your own, mm -hmm. for ye are bought with the price. Jesus. Therefore, glorify God in your bodies and in your spirit, which are God's. Hallelujah. I, I just I just want y'all to understand yeah. that you need to return to your rightful owner. Right. Yeah. All right, That's all right. You need you need you know we ain't talking about no slavery. That's right. That's right. That's right. We you need we need to return to our rightful owner. Creator and maker. Huh? Because yeah. It's God. That's right. Amen. Everything you have, bro, I don't care what you've been hearing all your life. Amen. How much you in charge and how much you, 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 you that much woman or you that much man. Amen. Without God, you are nothing. That's right. Amen. That's right. That's it. You don't even exist. That's right. Let's think about returning to your owner. Returning. The writer says in this text, he says, what know ye not? That your bodies is the temple of the Holy Ghost? In other words, 
you don't claim to be right. You don't claim to know Jesus and then be all dirty and filthy. Oh, <laughs> See, when, 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 when Christ <coughs> gives you something, when he, when, when he gives you something, it's going to be clean and holy. Right. Amen. You can't do anything with it. Yeah. Right. <coughs> you, 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 your mouth ought to, ought to be clean and holy. All right. Amen. Your walk ought to be clean and holy. Yeah. That's what Christ gave you. Yeah. And he gave you, and then you know what the scripture just said. Did y'all get it? Uh huh. Huh? All right. Did you get it when he said, which are God's? Uh-huh. Which ye have of God? Uh -huh. God gave it to you. Yeah, gave you didn't get it yourself. That's right. You could you can't maintain it yourself. That's right. You got it from God. From That's God. Right. And when you realize where it comes from and where it goes to, right. you're going to be a better steward for Christ. All right. The writer has laid it out for us that our bodies are the temple of the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Which is in you. Huh? Oh, and, and it's in you, huh? That's right. That's right. The Holy Ghost. Right. Oh, Lord, have mercy. This is going to be hard because a lot of y'all don't believe that y'all be holy. All right, all right, huh? Y'all right, right. don't believe that y'all set apart for the master's oh, yeah. use. My Lord. Yes, sir. But the scripture is telling us that you set apart. Be careful how you carry yourself. Amen. Right. Amen. The adversary he, he, he deals with us every day, day in and day out That's right. from our own little pea brain. That's right. A lot of times we're looking at other folks trying to make them be the problem. But, but it starts right here. That's right. That's it. Huh? That's it. it starts right with you. Don't yeah. Look, somebody said the other day, yeah. they say, it ain't my job to make you love me. It's my job to love you. To love you. That's right. It's my job to do God's will That's right. no matter what nobody else do. All right. All right. All right. They used to sing a song when I was a boy and say, I'll go if I have to go by myself. Amen. When, you, when you get that kind of mentality, Amen. you don't want to live by yourself now. Don't, 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 miss, don't get it misconstrued. Yeah. God has put us together as a body. Yeah. He want us together. He want us to... That's all right, Rick. When they started out in the book of Acts, they came together on what kind of card? That's how it started. That's right. You are, uh, we changed somewhere along the way. Right. I got mine, you got yeah. yours. But when God issued it out, it was on one accord. Amen. Satan has even got so, so, so bodies and bodacious. He'll come in the house and split a man and woman apart. Yeah. That God put together his husband and wife right. and have her stuff over him yeah. and his stuff over there. Nah, her thoughts over him All and right. his thoughts over there. Yeah. 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 Help us, Lord. It's all right. Cause ain't how God laid it out. That's right. Help us, Lord. That's right. He put us together yeah. as one yeah. body, yeah. many yeah. members, That's right. but one That's right. body. That's all right. Yeah. That's all right. As He laid it out for us. Yeah. Paul talks about it. Then you know what we'll do? We'll go down the street. No, no, we wouldn't do. We do it like the same. Can't get along in the house with the husband and wife. Yeah. First thing y'all do is call the pope. -po. <laughs> huh? All right. Poor boy ain't going to come straight out of nothing. Yeah. One of y'all got to leave away from here. He going to separate what God has put together, amen? All right. All right. That's what they do. That's the card, That's the standard that they operate by. Because they're scared y'all going to kill one another. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Go out there and call the Pope. I'm Paul talking to him about going and find other folks to iron out your problem, your situation. Uh, yeah. When you got the Holy Spirit in yeah. your heart. Yeah. Right now. You ought to just go on and take a loss rather than, 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 than put somebody in there that ain't got as much as you got right. or as much as your brother or sister have. Right. Paul laid it out for us mm -hmm. and told, and look, and he said, I dare you. I dare you to do it. You have the Holy Spirit within you, That's and then you're going to go out there and get somebody else. Mm. They ain't got nothing but a, 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 a law for you for the, for the judge you by. And you can't just say, well, I could have been wrong, sis. I could have been wrong, bro. All right. Huh? That's right. All right. You, can't, you can't do that. So you're going to get somebody else to try and balance out your side. Yeah. 
But Paul said, I dare you do that kind of stuff. Right. How dare you what? serve Jesus Christ? How dare you try to be a saint of God and then go through all the rigmarole of the world? All right. How dare you? All right. I dare you. <coughs> Paul is calling out and said to them, you, you, you're going to one day judge the world. <coughs> the Bible says you're going to judge angels. Yes, Lord. And you can't mean you cannot discern the small things of life. Mm -hmm. Nine out of ten things that we fall out about ain't about nothing. That's right. Amen. That's right. That's right. That's right. The writer is laying it out for us to have an understanding that we have to do the things that's of God. Mm -hmm. Not because you healed. Well, because you got his Holy Spirit dwelling in you. Because you belong to God. Yeah. You don't belong to yourself. That's right. Amen. Say that, Doc. Say that. Right. Huh? That's right. Amen. Scripture tells us we're going to judge angels and we ain't got sense enough to uh, come to some kind of rational decision be one to another. One to another. That's you right. better say it. The Scripture tells us if we bite and devour one another, uh -huh. we'll be consumed one of another. Yeah. <coughs> Just imagine you got a brother or sister that you don't think nothing more of. You gave, you gave Satan an advantage. Yes, yes, yes. Well, we won't just, it don't have to just be a brother. So sometimes we'll do it with our wife, yeah. with our husband, with yeah. our children. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, that's right. That's it. Oh, I don't, I don't fool with them. Mm -hmm. They ain't right. All right. Mm -hmm. It ain't right for you to say that or for you to think that. Amen, right. amen, But when you find Paul, Paul is pressing, it, pressing us to know that we are the church. And we should be esteeming one another as the church of Christ. Uh -huh. Not tearing one another down, not making one another. I got to be this big, this big, this big dog, oh, you know. <laughs> so everybody else got to be a little dog. Right now. Ain't no big dog, little dog. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. So you may as well draw the conclusion that Thank you. you belong to Christ, uh -huh. he belongs to Christ. That's right. That's right. The scripture tells us that whether we live or whether we die, we belong to who? To God. Christ. To Christ. That's it. You belong to Christ. Yes. Let me let, let me take let me take you to your own little pocketbook. The money in your pocketbook you consider belong to you, amen. All right. All right. <clears throat> it don't really belong to you, but you, you know you consider it belong to you. You use it. You use it like yeah. it. you use it like it's yours. Yeah. Somebody asks you, but well, I don't give you my money. Yeah. You gotta give it somewhere else. Huh? You better give it up. <laughs> well, get it like I got it. That was what we'll do. All right. All right. How do you think? How do you rationalize you belonging to God? Then you want to do everything you want to do. Yeah. Right. And nothing he wants you to do. Right, right. Yeah. Paul talked so vehemently, and he talked about some of the things that really beset us in life. Some of the things that keep us off God and, and won't let us get back right. And most of the time, they, they all apply to our flesh. Amen. Yeah. Paul said, I speak to your shame. Mm -hmm. Is it so that there is not a wise man among you? Mm -hmm. No. Huh? Not one. Mm -hmm. That you should be able to judge mm -hmm. between his brethren? Right. <clears throat> Come on now. Don't, don't run the church every day and then get out there and, and let the world consume you. That's right. That's right. Amen. Amen. Stand up for what's right yeah. according to the word of God. All right. Amen. All right. All right. That's all right. Huh? That's all right. You go before somebody that don't, that ain't got no faith trying to divide two people that's supposed to have faith in Christ. Huh. That don't even sound right, do it? No, no it don't. You, well, I'll do it like this. You love your wife better than anybody else in the world, amen? Mm -hmm. And then you're going to go down the street and get some, some woman to come straighten her out. Mm -hmm. Ain't going to work, I can tell you. Amen. Come on. God has set in order the works of the church. Mm -hmm. you, you're not going to be able to change it. I don't care what you do. He said, he said evidently, there's a fault somewhere. Mm -hmm. I just got to find the fault. 
I just got to find the fault. When I find the fault, I'll find myself being a better Christian. He said, now therefore there is utterly a fault among you because ye go to the law one with another. Why do ye rather not take, rather take wrong? Why do you not rather suffer yourselves to be defrauded? I got ready to kill a man one time, and the Holy Spirit told me, say, you going to kill the man by $15? <laughs> I know. <laughs> Light bulb went off. Boom! Mercy. I ain't asked the man about it. He dead and gone now. I can ask him all I want now. <laughs> but I didn't ask him not, not one more time about that $15. That's right. <laughs> because anything that's going to make you want to hurt your brother or your sister, you need to get rid of it. Amen? Amen. I don't care if it is the love of money. Don't be wrong and defraud one another. Amen? Amen. No, now, because we need to understand, we need to come to grips with the word of God. Yeah. Some of y'all trying to come to grips with Richard Cable, but that ain't going to get it. All right. It ain't going to get it. I promise you it ain't going to get it. That's right. That's right. That's right. Because the scripture, the scripture going to say it like this. Know ye not that the righteous shall inherit the kingdom of God? Uh -huh. No, you know that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God. If you don't get it right, the way God has laid it out, All right. you're not going to have a part with him. Amen. You're not going to have a part. Right. You can think about Marshall, Capers, or Bowman, or Ann, or anybody you want to think about, but it's really about God. All about God. All about it. It's all about God. Amen. Your your wee mentality yeah, yeah. is trying to turn you against God. Right. Not against Cable, not against Bowman, not against your brother or your sister, but it's against God. Right. David, 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 way back there, David got to shout it out. Huh. He said, told, told God, say, against thee and thee only have I sinned yeah. and done this great thing in your yeah. sight. Yeah. You're being mean to somebody. You ain't being mean to nobody but God. That's right. Somebody that's able to take you out and or, or not even make a motion. Yeah. And you won't be mean to him thinking you're being mean to somebody else. Amen? Amen. He laid it out for us. The un know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? Right. Be not deceived. Huh? Don't fool yourself. Don't let nobody else fool you. Right. And now this is what we all, he look, look, look where he put it in, in that, in that ninth verse. He said, neither fornicators, nor right. idolaters, uh -huh. nor adulterers, nor infectionate. Right. Some man don't know where he want to be a man or a woman. No, he didn't know abusers right. of themselves with mankind. Nor thieves, nor curious, nor drunkards, nor revilers, nor extortioners shall have inheritance in the kingdom of God. You got to realize that when you take these things upon you, that you put yourself out of the kingdom of God. You have to line up with the word of God. Amen? And don't let nobody deceive you. Huh? That's right. Hey, look. A lot of times people will tell you about how you used to be. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sure enough. Uh, That's right. <laughs> oh, yeah, they, they know. Don't think they don't know you. They don't know you. They, they know your history now. They know your history, amen. That's right. That's right. But, but Paul said, such were some of you. But you know why? They weren't there for the water to clear. Huh? They, they were nowhere around when you, when you say, I believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of God, that, that he suffered and died on the cross yeah, for my sin. Right. Huh? Right. They were nowhere around when you did that 180. Yeah. When you repented from wherever you were going. Amen? All right. All right. They were nowhere around, but they'll tell you, I know, I know, yeah. I know, I know yeah. your history. Yeah. Uh, one time, my fellow told me this. I, hey, I know what you're yours. I said, you, boy, I don't know how I was so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> then he said, that little crazy. You you gonna admit you uh, yeah. That's right. yes. Yes. yeah, anytime I'm setting up a life or anything that's outside of the will of God, the Bible gonna still call you a, a, a foolish. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's right. How you gonna do that and then serve God too? Yeah, that's right. It's not gonna work. All right, man. Try to fool your husband, try to fool your wife, try to fool your friend. 
Try to fool anybody you want, but you'll never, never. be able to fool God. Never. No, 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 never. Matter of fact, my Bible teacher said it like this right here. He said, boy, <laughs> some of them prayers you hear ain't even out these walls. <laughs> huh? All right. There were nothing but words spoke out and cast out. God knows your heart. And that's what he deal with. He won't let me in your heart because I'll probably mess it up. But he deal with your heart. He knows your heart. That's right. That's when God knows your heart, you better believe his, ju his, his judgment is going to be just and true. All right. Yes, God. You're not going to be able to get away from him. Yes, God. The writer said that he was washed, uh -huh. but ye are sanctified, yeah. but ye are justified yes. in the name of our Lord Jesus and by the Spirit of our God. All right. When God changed you, yeah. no, yeah. may not have been there. No, I've been changed. Yeah. People can be standing right beside you, and the Holy Spirit change your whole life, you and they still looking at the same individual. You say that. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Holy Spirit going to change you out. All right, man. And they still be treating you like you the same person. You right, man. And you, you, you done got so humble in me. You ain't saying nothing. They just beat you down. Man, you ain't saying they just beat you down. And you ain't got to say nothing because you know Jesus got my back. Huh? Let him beat you down. That's all right. That's all right. Show sure up. Yeah. Thank you. Paul is laying down what Christ has already laid. And that's a foundation for us to walk on. Yeah. You walk on it. On that foundation, we'll find ourselves in the spirit of our God. Amen. Amen. Paul, Paul, Paul say, look, all things are lawful unto me. Uh -huh. But all things are not expedient. Not everything I can do is going to represent Jesus Christ. Yeah. Huh? That's right. Amen. That's right. Oh, well, you, you, you can do anything you see your friend do. Yeah. Amen. Huh? Yeah, you, you go on and then do it too. <laughs> but it's going gonna, it's gonna to demote you. You're going to be... You don't get a bad grade. Yeah. Yeah. Right. You don't get no good grade doing what your friend do. All, right. you say it. All things are, but it's not expedient. All things are lawful for me, but I will not be brought under the power of any. Yeah. Mm. I don't care who or how much I love you. If God said this is the way it's got to be, this is the way it's got to be. Yeah. It ain't going to change. Yeah. Amen. Amen. That's, right. Amen. That's it. They stoned Stephen trying to get him to go the other way. Yeah. But they stoned him calling on the name of the Lord. Yeah. That's the position that we have to take That's in right. Christ Jesus. That's right. That we're going to stand up for him. Yeah. All right. For Christ I live and for Christ yeah. I die yeah. is not just a cliche. That's right. It's not. It's not. It's the truth. It's the truth. It's the truth. It's the truth. Jesus. It is critical that we know what we stand for. Yeah. 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 Say, I will not be brought under the power of any. Me for the better and the better for me. Yeah. But God shall destroy both it and them. Mm -hmm. So why are you worrying about that? They're going to both be blood destroyed, right? Right. Amen. Now the body is not for fornication, right. but, for the but for the Lord. But for the Lord. Right. And the Lord for the body. That's right. Oh, y'all ain't going to tell me. Right. Really, I, I like to play around, have my Fun, we call it, amen. All right, <laughs> All right. I know anybody gonna tell you. You, you go to many churches, they ain't gonna hard to tell you this in him. Tell it. You say it. You huh? Say it. Cause they like to play too. <laughs> say it. Same let, But let me tell you, your play is costing you. That's right. That's right. Huh? Amen. It's costing you. Yo, yo, yo. So. Yeah. Jesus. You can't go do that stuff. And then represent Christ. That's right. Yeah. Decreasing. That's right. Oh, that's right. And, and we're going to get to some part that's going to tell you you ain't in the world no way. You All ain't right. got no business in the world. Huh? All right. Thank you, Lord. But for the Lord. And the Lord for the body. Mm -hmm. And God has both raised up the Lord and will also raise up us yeah. by his own power. Yes, Lord. Right. You mean to tell me you're going to do the opposite of Jesus Christ huh. and then look for God to raise you up? Mm. Oh, Lord. My God, my God. Come on! Jesus. You just can't, it ain't going to work out like that. That's right. God said, I'm going to raise, he raised up Christ uh -huh. and he'll raise you up. 
Huh? Right. Not, not by your power. By his power. By his own yeah. power. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. God, God got a love for you that you, you, you'll never understand. That's right. That's right. You'll That's never right. be able to grasp That's what he cares for you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. So true. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. So don't don't love the world and the things that's of the right. world that's more right. than you love somebody that gave their own son to die on the cross for you. Jesus. How how this gonna be? All right. The little mind and my new stuff that you gonna let pull you off base. Yeah. That's all right. Mm. Huh? That's all right. By his own power. Yeah. <clears throat> Know you not that your bodies are the members of Christ? Yes. Shall I then take the members of Christ and make them, and make them members of, of, of an harlot? Yes. God forbid. God forbid. God forbid. Yeah. How you gonna what, what you gonna how you gonna do this? This ain't this is not natural, my brothers and sisters. How you gonna do it? All right. <laughs> You're going to have to leave off Christ. Yeah. And God requires us to have a certain respect for one another. Right. Then, then look, it's so, it's so bad. I learned this a long time ago, and it slowed my roll down. It didn't quite stop it at the time, but it slowed it down oh, very yeah. much. Huh? Yeah, all right. It said, what? Yeah. Know ye not that he that joins himself unto a harlot is one body? Uh-huh. For... Two said he shall be one flesh. You don't think about that. I, I, I talked to some men pretty rough on this on this line. Yeah. How, 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 how well do you like your friend? Yeah. How well do you like your acquaintance? I say, I tell you what y'all do. Get you a shot glass of his blood, his blood, his blood, his blood, his blood. <laughs> now y'all take y'all a drink of the shot. Man, you must be crazy. <laughs> I say when you cross over the line where they been, it's yeah. just like drinking their blood. Yeah. Yeah. The Bible yeah. bags it up so you become one flesh. One flesh. Everything they done did, you done did. Right. Everything yeah. you done did, they done did. Yeah. And you having fun now. They having fun. Man. That's some good fun. Ooh, wee. Look how yeah. That's some fun. That's what we call it, fun. Huh? Yeah. Man, I showed out. Thank you, Lord. But God has laid it out for us not to do the things that he despised for us to do. Yeah. Huh? All right. But he that is joined unto the Lord one spirit. is one spirit. That's right. Oh, my Lord. Just imagine when, when Satan... Can I, I'm going to give you a perfect example. When, when Jesus was tempted by Satan, uh -huh. mm -hmm. he had a word for him. That's right, that's right, that's right. He had a word for him. Right. So in other words, what? If you're going to walk the walk that he walked, you got to have, have a word. You got to have a word, that's right. But you're not the word. You know, we want miracles, true enough. But we want this 66 books to jump out, out off them pages and just bust our heart wide open. You gotta jump into it. Huh? All right. Jump into the book. Come on, bro. All right. Study to show yourself approved. Well, that's right. Oh, that's a workman right. under God, rightfully right. dividing right. the word right. of truth. Right. You didn't get to be no teacher by it because the, 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 the books jumped off on you. That's right. <laughs> Uh, you didn't get to be no nurse because the book jumped off on you. Right. You put in the time and effort. That's right. That's right. And just because you ain't going to draw a check, so to speak, from the word of God, yeah. you don't pick the word of God up not one day in your life. Right. It's a crying shame. Hallelujah. You can go to work and tell the steps of your job from All point right. A to point B. All right. If somebody walked up and said, how can I be saved? Hmm. Let me go call Pastor Bone. <laughs> mm. Mm. All right now. All right now. Well, that's, that, that's the church's job. Yeah. It's to draw the world to Christ. Christ. That's right. Jesus. You need to know how. Yeah. Christ is in 
You need to be able to break the bread of life. Yeah. What if you'd have been filled with God told him to join himself to the chariot? Mm. Philip walked up and said, well, you understand what you read? Okay. He said, how can I accept some man guide me? Yeah, that's right. He said, what? Hmm. Hmm. See, in the scripture, say Philip began at that same scripture yeah. that's it. and preached to him preached Jesus. Teaching. That's right. Jesus. So when you find yourself anchored in the word of God, you need to know mm -hmm. and run away from the stuff that's not of God. Be one spirit with God. Right. Run away from the thing that you think you like so well. Yeah. Huh? Because yeah. look, look, the Bible says this. Say every sin that a man do, he do without the body. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But when a joker fornicating, laying around sleeping with somebody, yeah. he doing it in his own body. Yeah. Huh? All right. Sin it against his own body. That's and then won't nobody tell you not to do it. Don't do it. Please don't do it. Don't go there. What kind of time? Where am I at, y'all? All right. Don't y'all let me talk too long now. But look. Speak long. <laughs> God is a loving God. Yes, he is. And he wants you, you, and you, and you. No matter what your mindset is right now. Yeah. He'd offer you a change. That's right. Thank you, Lord. That's right. And all you got to do is accept it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes. He said, if, if, if you come in and sup with me, uh -huh. then I'll sup with you. Yeah, I'll with you. Huh? Yeah. Got it, got it, got it. It's waiting on you. Behold, I stand at the door and no, if you're in it, yeah. man, open unto me. Yeah. I'll come in and sup with him and he with me. Amen? Amen. Now, 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 we're talking about Jesus. returning to our rightful owner, right? Right. That's right. Let us let us look, cause we need to be on one accord to get to that place, don't we? Right. Okay. One accord in one place. Yeah. First uh -huh. Corinthians third chapter, looking at verse eleven. We ain't got far to go. We ain't got far to go. Right. I'm trying to get out of here. All right now. Huh? Amen. First Corinthians third chapter. Mm -hmm. Verse eleven. Eleven and twenty three. Amen. All right. 11 through 23. Isn't that what he said to, to us now? Yeah. Huh? All right. Man. For other foundation can no, can no man lay and than that is laid, which is Jesus Christ. That's right. Yes, sir. God both bothered and finished this thing, y'all. That's right. I don't care what you're standing on. If you ain't standing on Jesus Christ, All right. you standing on sinking sand. Amen? That's it. That's it. Now, if any man build upon this foundation, gold, gold or silver, precious stone, wood, wood hay, or scrubble, yeah. every man's work shall be made manifest. Yeah. You don't think God know what you're doing? All right. You don't think God know what you're thinking? All right. You don't think God know what you're plotting? He knows. Or what you plan? He knows. All your declare it because it shall be revealed by fire and the fire shall try yeah. every man's work of what sort it is. Right. Yep. Well, it's going to be good or bad. Yeah. Huh? That's alright, Cable. That's alright. Jesus. If any man works shall be burned up. Now let's see. If any man works abide which he has built thereupon he shall Receive a reward. That's right. Many man work shall be burned, uh -huh. he shall suffer loss. Uh -huh. But he himself shall be saved. Yeah. Yet it's so by fire. Uh -huh. In other words, what you want to be? I want my soul to be saved. Y'all yeah. Yeah, don't remember the peanut butter jelly boy, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Mama trying to feed him peanut butter and jelly. Yeah. And he said, I don't want no peanut butter and jelly. I want my soul to be saved. All right, man. And all your work is manifest before God. Amen. Amen. So he knows everything that's going on. Right. Huh? You're right. As he, as, as he, as he laid it out so, yeah. so vehemently for us. He said, let no man deceive himself. That's right. 
If any man among you seem to be wise in this world. Let him. Oh, we got some smart folks in the world now. <laughs> um, but listen at what the scriptures say now. In this world, yeah. let him become a fool right. that he may be wise. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Look, Paul came from the sand. He's a counselor. Yeah, he was right. up there with the big boys <laughs> walking and talking. Yeah. But when he got Jesus Christ, uh -huh. he said, look, I count all that stuff with dumb. Yeah. For the excellency of Christ, amen. All right, mm -hmm. Christ gonna weigh out over everything that you think you know or everything you think you want to learn. Right. Christ is gonna be the top of all of it, amen. 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 But he, he talked to them in a way yeah. that they could understand. For the wisdom of this world uh -huh. is foolishness with God. With God. Yeah. Oh, what are, what are you teaching? Yeah. What are you teaching your children? <laughs> Right now. If you ain't teaching them the word of God, you're teaching them the wisdom of the world. That's right. Yes. That's right. And God says it's foolishness. It's foolishness. Yeah. That's right. It ain't going to be able to help them do nothing but get into more and, and more, more and trouble more and more problems more. And, 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 and situations. That's right. But if you can give them the word of God and let them have Jesus Christ in their heart, yeah. I got a way out now. That's right. Huh? All right. Though you slay me. Yeah, yeah. Y'all, y'all better talk to some of them church folk. <laughs> they were the real church yeah, folk. Yeah. Though you slay me, yet I'm gonna save you. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. The wisdom of this world is foolishly with God. Mm -hmm. For it is written, mm -hmm. He taketh the wine in their own craftiness. Mm -hmm. Oh, you think you slick. <laughs> <laughs> huh? All right. You think Boy, you got it going on? You better say it. <laughs> and I don't know, but if you don't know the scripture, right. you don't know that God already oh, really? tripped your trigger. <laughs> and then somebody walk up and tell you, say, hey, some of God got some folks too that can perceive. Uh -huh. uh, what, what, what the man said, told Paul, said, I perceive that thou art in a God of building. Huh? All right. So, so, so you, you ain't going to fool God. You fool some of the folks some of the time. Right. The writer said you can't fool all the folks oh, oh, none of the none. time. That's right. Huh? Jesus. God said if it were possible, uh -huh. you would fool the very elect. Yeah. Yeah. If it were possible, but yeah. it's not possible. God got some folk walking around here you can't fool. That's right. Amen. That's right. That's right. That's right. Amen. They see you like a big pot of soup. <laughs> he take them in their own craftiness. And again, the Lord knows it. The thoughts of the wise that they are vain. Uh, yes, yes. Not all this stuff you rattling in your brain, plotting in day in and day out, yeah. sitting around with other folks talking about it, working it up, building it up, piling it up. Yeah. And the scriptures say it's vain. vain. It ain't. It's empty. <laughs> ain't nothing to it. All right. Yes, sir. Don't let God get you, catch you out there like that. Yeah. Therefore, let let no man glory in men. That's right. For all things are yours. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. All right. You don't hear me? All right. Oh, yeah. For all things are yours. He said, look at, look at it. He said, look. Whether Paul or Apollos, uh -huh. Cephas or the world, yeah. or life or death, right. or things present or things to come, uh -huh. all are yours. Yeah. Finish it up for me in that third, 23rd verse. What did he say? Who you belong to, and ye are Christ's, and Christ is God. Everything in this world belongs to God and His Son. Hallelujah! Stop thinking that you you all that in a bag of chips. That's right. You belong to Him, Amen. 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 Romans fourteen seven to thirteen. Oh, I'm getting down now. I'm getting down. Romans fourteen. Seven. Verse 7. Look at him. He's looking at what he's saying now. Yeah. Look, I'm, I'm so proud of myself. I live like I want to live. I do like I want to do. I think like I want right to think. Now. Can't nobody tell me how to think. Right I'm grown. Right now. <laughs> huh? Yeah. 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 I'm grown. <coughs> and ain't nobody going to make me do nothing else no different. Cut the yeah. Cut but, the but listen at what, what, the, what the word said. For none of us live to himself. Yeah. Right. Oh, where you, where, where, you, where you at now? 
And no man died to himself. For whether we live, we live unto the Lord. And whether we die, we die unto the Lord. Whether we live, therefore, or die, we are the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, sir. Hallelujah. Thank you, sir. We belong to the Lord. Yes. For to this end, Both. it played out. Ain't just no accident. Yeah. Ain't just no coincidence. He said, for this end, mm -hmm. Christ both died and rose and revived that ye might be, Lord. that he might be Lord both. of both the dead and living. Yeah. But why do thou judge thy brother? Why do thou set it no yeah. thy brother? Yeah. For we shall all stand before the judgment seat of Christ. Amen. It's coming up again. Coming up. Amen. Right That's right. For it is written, as I live, saith the Lord, every knee shall bow to me, and every tongue shall confess. To God. Huh? You don't hear me? Every tongue shall confess to God. Thank you, Lord. Oh Lord. Yeah, so then, mm -hmm. every one of us shall give account of himself to God. To God. That's right. Show no. That's right. Ain't gonna be no lying up in now. That's right. Don't say nothing. That's right. Ain't, ain't no crafty or wickedness gonna be in there. Right. No. We're gonna have to give an account right. to God. He ain't gonna be able to call me in the witness for you, amen. amen. All right now. Amen. I ain't gonna be able to help you. I can't even help little Michael, that pretty wife I got. They got to stand on their own. My mom said a long time ago, every tub set on what? Oh, it's own bottom. Right. When it comes to the Lord, everybody have to set on their own standards whether they're going to live for Christ. That's right. But I'm telling you, I don't care who it is. They're standing right beside you, yeah. whether they handcuffed to you. Right. If they decide they're going to live for something other than Christ, mm -hmm. you live That's for Christ. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's right. Yes, Paul told the Galatians to stand fast now for the liberty wherewith Christ has made us free. Yes. And be not entangled again with the yoke of bondage. Well, Stay out of that mess. Yes. It ain't going to do nothing but tie you up, you up forever and forever. Amen. 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 God has laid it out for us. Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm going to go sit down. But I'm going to do one thing before I go sit down. Right now. Romans in his 12th chapter. Where that? Romans 12 chapter, looking at the first verse. Okay. I, I, I skipped some things, but I'm gonna, this is what I'm going to drop off in right here. Amen? Amen. Amen. That's a good one. See, Amen. See, see, when you have a dedication, Amen. you'll wind up in these yeah. verses right here. He said, I beseech you, therefore, brothers, yes, yes, yes. by the mercies of God. Now, God will take care of you all this time. Don't care what you were doing, where you were going, how you no. were acting, what you were looking like. No. By the mercies of yeah. God. Yeah. That she, I can't do it for you. Right. Huh? Mama right. can't do it for you. All right. Daddy right. can't do it for you. Jesus. Your friend can't do it for you. All right. He Amen. said that she present your bodies yeah. a living sacrifice. Oh, I love well, I'm going I'm, 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 I'm to expound on it. My flesh wants to do something that ain't got no business doing. Uh -huh. mm. You think my flesh going to be quiet? Mm. You think it going to fight me? Mm. It's going to fight me. Yeah. So now I just become a living <coughs> sacrifice. Because yeah. 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 I ain't going to do it. I ain't going to do it. I ain't going to do it. Right now. I ain't going to do it. <laughs> I am a living sacrifice. 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 Holy yes. and acceptable yes. under God. God. You ain't got to worry about what I think or feel. Right. That's right. That's it. Yeah. That's right. it. Unto God. Yes. Holy and acceptable under God. Right. He knows Caper's old brain. He knows when he's trying to pull a fast one. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. So I ain't going to be able to worry about what you're going to think. Which is your reasonable service. Uh -huh. service. That's right. It's just reasonable. Reasonable. Just reasonable. Mm -hmm. Now this is the part that causes us more problems than anything else. And be not conformed to this world. To this world. Yeah. Everything we like. That's right. Mostly is yeah. in this world. It's in that word. Everything we like to speak about. Everything we like to see. Yeah. Is in the it's word. In that word. 
It's in the world. All right. Show sure up. But the Bible tells us to be not conformed. Or oh, you can glaze at it or get a glance at it every now and then. Yeah. But don't be conformed don't to it. it. That's right. Huh? Don't give in. That's Sometimes right. I get mad when my boy come yeah. home and he's got the first thing he want to do is grab the, the TV or grab the laptop or grab something to look at. Make me angry. <laughs> <laughs> boy, put that thing down. You don't need to turn it on. What? Yeah, you just don't like me too much. You don't want me to do nothing. <laughs> Put that stuff down. I don't know. When I went to school, the old teachers told us that you are what you eat. Right, you eat. So if you eat all that junk up on that thing, that's going to be what you are. Yeah. Not going to be able to change. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed, transformed yeah. by the renewing of your mind. Yeah. That she may prove what is that good an acceptable and perfect will of God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. That's your daily deportment. Yes, yes. And then believe me, you go. He, what did he say? Become a living sacrifice. sacrifice. You're gonna be some pain. Yes. Yeah. Gonna be some sorrow. Gonna be some hurt. But you're gonna have to stand up and say, "For Christ I live, for Christ I die." Yeah. Just. Turn yourself over yes. to your rightful owner. Amen. Huh? Hard mind, soul, and strength. Amen? Amen. God bless you. God keep you. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you. Amen. Return. Return. <laughs>